Good morning. My name is Kevin Crosby, and I am from the, oh, excuse me, I, I am in my fourth and final year here at UW-Madison. I'm from the D.C. metropolitan area, called the DMV, affectionately by people familiar with the culture. Specifically, I'm from Prince George's County, Maryland. There is where I gained my foundation and my purpose. While my home is not perfect, I can say that I've always felt supported and understood by my community. Growing up around people who looked like me, spoke like me, had similar experiences as me, this gave me a sense of belonging and worthiness. While there aren't as many people in Madison who sound like me or look like me, I feel that many of the organizations I've had the opportunity to be a part of, primarily the Posse Foundation, have given me an opportunity to retain a semblance of the rich culture and diversity I became accustomed to in my youth. The Posse Foundation's full tuition scholarship not only provided a way for me to attend a world-class university here in Madison, but also connected me with an amazing network of individuals, each striving for success in their own way. Posse pushed me to discover what true success meant in my life, and for that, I'm immensely grateful. I've always had an interest in biology. <laughs> Thankfully, I was blessed with a family that, that fostered my scholastic interest from early on, supplying me with National Geographic magazines in elementary school, supporting me through science bowl competitions and countywide science fair competitions in middle school. My family, specifically my mother, my father, my brother, allowed me to hone and refine my scholastic interests. An adolescent health struggle served to further refine these interests as my interest in nutrition initially began in my teens as I searched for methods to lose weight. This influenced my decision to pursue a bachelor's degree in nutritional sciences, to which I've added a certificate in environmental studies. I now know that nutritional practices and health outcomes are intimately related to the state of the environment through exploration of topics ranging from infant mortality to the environmental factors that impact the transmission of zoonoses, coronavirus. Um, my academic programs have built a foundation for my professional interest in public health and equity. And Madison, in turn, has provided the backdrop for the exploration of these interests. From conducting clinical research at UW Health, to volunteering as an emergency department volunteer at VA hospital, to working in my freshman dorm as a cultural coalition coordinator. I feel that the opportunities I've been able to pursue at UW are ones that are only unique to the city. These experiences have enriched me more than I could have imagined prior to coming to Wisconsin, and for that, I'm immensely grateful. The most gratifying group of opportunities I've had, the, I've participated in in Madison have been related to my efforts to pass knowledge on to those younger than myself and redefine the narrative surrounding black success. Too often, when I tell people that I go to UW-Madison, they ask, what position or what sport? Automatically assuming that a black man in college must be involved in some form of collegiate athletics. Unfortunately, this experience is not unique to myself. Many black men have had these same experience and been asked these same questions. Questions that speak to the inability of some to see black achievement beyond entertainment or athletics. I see my work in both local elementary schools as a badge of volunteers, mentor, and my position at UW Health as a hope mentor, as ways to eliminate the social stigma surrounding black excellence. These positions have allowed me to influence the next generation of leaders before negative stereotypes have their opportunity to deter them from what they are destined for. Everything I've been a part of in Madison has prepared me to move forward in my journey. Since early childhood, I've wanted to have a tangible impact on the health and wellness of my community. I now look to satisfy that desire by becoming a physician. In the fall, I plan on making the next step in my path to medicine, as I will, upon securing funding, become the pub begin the public health master's program at Cambridge University. This will add a global perspective to my interest in combating health inequities. In the public health master's program, I will work under the tutelage of Dr. Simon Griffin in the prevention of diabetes and related metabolic disorders in high-risk groups program. My time at Cambridge will prepare me for my career in medicine by improving my understanding of the implications of individual healthcare decisions on the, decision, on the status um, of the health of the population. In the next part of my journey, I look forward to continuing what I started here in Madison. As I expand my network and forge new relationships, I hope to embody the Wisconsin idea and use my education to positively influence the lives of people, not just inside, but outside of academia. While I will not be in Madison much longer, it gives me great joy to know that my work here will continue after I leave. 
I will forever be indebted to this institution and the greater Madison community for all the amazing times I've been afforded over the past four years. These experiences made me into what I am today and make me proud of my identity as a Badger. Thank you.